Leicester travelled to the Rico Arena on Saturday afternoon to face Wasps in round 10 of the Aviva Premiership. The last time these two sides met was in last season's semi-final. Wasps taking the spoils on that day and they were looking to back it up with another victory here. But it was the Tigers who took the lead through a George Ford penalty and things got even better for the away side as they got their first try of the match on 13 minutes. It was a family affair as Ben Youngs found his brother Tom who finished well from close range. Wasp responded with a try on 22 minutes through South African Nizam Carr. Number eight, who's impressed since joining on a short-term deal, powered over as he latched on to a Dan Robson pass. The scrum half then took his side into a lead as he burrowed over from close range on 31 minutes. Elliot Daly extended that lead to seven points as he landed a long-range penalty just before the break. The Tigers needed to respond after half-time, and they did just that. Jonah Holmes, the man to cross on his Premiership debut. Superb hands from Will Evans and Valentino Mapapalangi set up the winger who dotted down. Holmes then got his second minutes later as he latched on to a looping pass from Vili LaRue. The former Wasp man ran in from over 80 metres, bending off Christian Wade and finishing superbly. Jimmy Gopeth reduced the gap to two points as he landed a penalty on 60 minutes. Dai Young's side then regained the lead through Daly, the winger showing his pace as he finished off a well-executed backline move. Ford levelled the scores with 11 minutes remaining as he landed his second penalty. However, the day belonged to the home side as they scored with a minute remaining on the clock. Danny Cipriani, the orchestrator, his delayed pass sat up perfectly for Kin and Mile, and the second row powered through the tackle of Toulouse Veanu to score. Gopeth added the extras, giving his side the bragging rights once again. The final score from the Rico was 32, Leicester 25.